boy Mike Wong yesterday was tweet. I said that boy Mike Wong was tweet. Hey, he wasn't tweeting that much, man. But, yo, only thing he said was, man, a, a lot of people was asking about what were the changes that happened yesterday. And he said only a handful of gameplay changes. And now uh, these are some that he dropped out there. Addressed an issue that was preventing custom difficulty levels from working as intended. Uh, I, I guess I, we'll talk about that in a second. Increase the frequency of putbacks to bring them more in line with what was expected. Oh, you know, the expected levels or whatever right there. This right here, bro. This right here. We're gonna call that one the Brutal Sim Patch. I ain't gonna lie, man. That dude loves trying to go in to get putbacks, and y'all already know. He probably just said in his uh said in his video. Another thing that he said that was very important was this one right here, adrenaline boost. Adrenaline boost uses has been disabled when sprinting off ball uh went on offense a lot of people were, were wanting to make that be one of those things man uh it's one of those things that we have played around and we've been able to deal with but it is great man and we're gonna talk about that later on in the, in the thing too man adjusted the logic for body up animations um to improve the reliability their reliability in certain circumstances i'm not gonna lie to y'all man this one right here is a big dub if it works, man, because like I said, man, we want these stonewall animations and we want all this stuff to be working, man. When we when we get in front of somebody, you block somebody off, you want them to not be able to go any further. And then last but not least, he says, you know, with, with a game, a handful of them, fix the coaches, fix some issues with the coach's clipboard to allow ace tempo and rebound settings to work properly. Now, I ain't gonna lie to y'all, man. That's a good amount of things that they fix, man. And a lot of these things are things that we were asking for. And we so big kudos to them. Big shout out to Mike Wong. But before before we get started man make sure y'all like the video and comment mike down below and that's gonna do two things for y'all number one every single week we give away every single friday we give away $50 in VC Cash App, or we give away a copy of a video game, whatever it is, man. That's number one. Number two, if we can average 8K views uh, per video this month, we're giving away a next-gen console, whether it be an Xbox, a PlayStation, or 500 bucks, or a laptop or something like that. A y'all's choice, man. We're going to be doing that. And last but not least, the bots trying to get back. I am keep knocking them off, and uh, they, but, you know, they keep trying to come back. So, man, just make sure y'all be very careful about that, man. I'm not giving away uh, an iPad and an I, I, I iMac and, and what? What, what is the other, the other one? The, uh, the MacBook Pro. I'm not giving away all that stuff. I'm definitely not putting my phone number down there. And I don't have Telegram. And nobody that I know has Telegram. Brutus M, All City, uh, Bash Plug. We are not going to be telling y'all to hit us up on Telegram, man. We just don't got that. And without further ado, good morning out there at 2K Land, man. So like we said, man, those were some of the changes that happened on yesterday, man. A lot of people are happy with them. A lot of people are, you know... A lot of people had a few things to say about them. I don't think that there's anything that we could that we could really take away that is a negative on the whole thing. We are going to run through the patch notes because they definitely dropped the whole deal on the patch notes. So we're gonna kind of run through them real quick. Um, I'm not going to I'm not going to sit here and go through every single patch note. I'm just gonna go through the stuff that I feel like is very important and uh, all that good stuff. We did go through some of those things. We might reiterate a few of the things that we went through, but uh, let's just get let's just get started right here, man. So uh, the number one the number one thing that I that I that I know that we talked about yesterday was this right here, and it was just talking about uh, the preparation preparations for the NBA 2K23 season three launching this Friday, uh, December second at 8 a.m. Pacific Standard Time. Stay tuned for all that we have in store. And uh, you know, they just got some stuff up there and they're just talking about the Bill Russell logo. The Bill Russell logo has been added to the court apron of all 28 teams. You know, the Black Lives Matter uh, logo has been added to the court floor of the WNBA teams. 2021 uh, championship, 2021-2022 championship banner has been added to the Golden State Warriors. Uh, George Mikan, uh, retired 99 jersey, has been added to the Los Angeles Lakers. You know, we, we already know that. Baseline team word, baseline team word marks and corner championship trophy uh, graphics have been added and uh, you know the mascots of the mascots of the Milwaukee Bucks and the Philadelphia 76ers have been updated to reflect the real life changes so that's something that's cool right there man I'm not gonna lie to y'all man and then the following player likenesses have been uh, have <laughs> have been updated and y'all already know what it is man that boy check it out boy that boy O'Shea Brisket O'Shea you made it baby you already know what it is man you are now an NBA 2K Hall of Fame it don't matter what happened from here. 
everybody using that jump shot. So many people using that jump shot. They had to put OJ Brissett in the game and update his likeness, man. They just show y'all, man. They just be throwing anything out there sometimes. And then they have to come back and update them. That was the only person that I felt like that, that we really needed to, um, that we really needed to, to, to check on or whatever, you know, they got Robert Williams, Iowa Williams, uh, D'Angelo Russell. But, uh, you know, I just thought that was cool. Ron Harper Jr. Bro, am I that old? Am I that old? Ron Harper Jr. Bro, let me tell y'all, last night I was looking at something and it said, I saw, uh, I saw Michael Pitts Jr. And I said, Michael Pitts Jr. And I said, yo, I am not that old. There's no way I'm that old. And then I checked it out. I mean, he took his helmet off and I said, that boy looks just like his daddy. So I ain't even got to Google it to check it out. I know that's Michael Pittman. Uh, is it Michael? Michael Pittman. Michael Pittman that used to play for the, uh, the, 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 the Tampa Bay Buccaneers, the running back. And his son is 6'4". He play a wide receiver for the doggone Indianapolis Colts. It's crazy, man. So I'm like, that's crazy that I'm that old that Ron Harper Jr. is not only in the league, but he's playing for, bro, is this his rookie year? something like this i don't let me i gotta check out some stats man ron harper jr he's six six just like his daddy though i didn't even know that this dude was in the league but yeah uh yeah i guess this is his freaking his rookie year bro i am that old we are officially old heads when all those guys that we remember playing they got their sons and just like i saw uh the play for the hawks uh aj griffin i was like aj griffin and then um i said is that adrian griffin jr and then i just saw his face and yeah that's 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 his son so you know it is what it is man anyway keep up we're gonna keep it going right here man we got uh chucky <laughs> Chucky Brown, all this stuff, man. We, we don't care about nothing about none of that stuff. We already went over the gameplay stuff uh, where it says addressing the issue, preventing, you know, all that good stuff. So we already gone over that. And like we said, the only two things that really matter are to us are uh, adjusting, the, uh, adjusting the body up logic, the adrenaline boost, and then, uh, you know, I think in the frequency of putbacks, but only only Brute really care about that. So we're not really worried about that. Jordan Challenge, the additional uh, additional blue three-point line on the Cleveland Cavaliers court in the shot and the 69-point game have been added. So we're not really worried about that. The wreck in the theater and all that good stuff, man. Let, let's see, see what we got. Uh, see what we got on that with the wreck and the theater and all that. Like I said, I don't think these are a lot of things that we really, really are worried about, but it just says continue to improve, continue to improvements to the performance and the stability that they have. I know we had a lot of people whose who's, uh, games were cutting off when they went to wrecking theater. They couldn't even really play it, so that's cool. Resolve some of the daily pick them uh, to ensure that the results appear correctly uh, on the rewards and all that good stuff. What y'all need, I understand y'all with the daily pick them, man, but what y'all need to do is, re is work on that daily spin and, and make it so that once I have reached level 40, I don't get I don't get double XP anymore because you can't carry them to the next season and you can and, and and they do nothing for you. So we, we that's something that we really need to look at. Uh, look at right there. Uh, let me see. Players and squads will now properly leave uh, pro am walk on together. So that's cool. Fix the fix the rare disconnect that could occur during the intro of some uh, city and any up games. So that was cool right there. You know, people getting kicked out of games right there. Player matchup overlay will now appear as expected during rec games and uh intros to play a matchup overlay i think that i don't know if that's when you press y and you can see it i don't know why they took that out of the game i wish they would put that back in the game so we can kind of get a scouting report on what we had but i'm hoping that that's what that is man we they don't really say it but you know uh it is what it is my career quest you know just continue to fix and adjustments just various fixes and stuff like that this is a lot of stuff that we're really not worried about we're really not really into that much but you know uh you know they're just saying resolve issues with endorsements i do know some people that had that fixed rare timing conflict that will prevent progression in the j cole music one of my partners said he had that issue so i'm glad they fixed that made an adjustment to improve tracking of the vehicle we, we really don't care about that addressed an issue that caused certain seasonal quests to not track correctly between saves that is the most important thing that they could have possibly done there uh let me see this this right here this one right here uh address an issue where certain quests didn't say because Brute was literally forced to play with one guy the entire time. So, you know, that's that's it right there. I think that's the most important deal off of that one, man. And, um, and let's see what else we got. Um, on 2K, let's see. I don't 
really see anything else. I mean, they got the my NBA and the W. I don't know if anybody's really doing any of those things and all of that good stuff, man. But yeah, it just seems like they just made some minor fixes and stuff like that. So I'm cool with that. I think that I think that it's overall the patch is gonna be a W. They did say um what was my guy? Uh, all city was saying that it saved that it saved some stuff. Uh, that the saves was working now but when I, every time i quit out or go out it's not working for me so that's that's a big thing right there man but look you know that's all we got to say about that for right now now the next thing that we want to talk about man hey man i ain't gonna lie man my boy utx the, uh uh jay-z the don man check it out man hey these joints is fire i know y'all been seeing them all over twitter and stuff these avatars and stuff i'm getting some made for me right now and uh you know the magic avatar it's telling me i got 18 minutes remaining or whatever like that so you know i, I gotta wait i gotta wait on those but you know hey it says you gotta download the, he told me i said man, you gotta teach me what to do he said you gotta download the lens app and 299 get you 50 photos or whatever so hey it is what it is it just, they just automatically from what i can tell it just automatically generates them joints man and uh you know you just get you just get to have some fun magic avatars i ain't gonna lie boy hey if you was one of them doggo hey i, I ain't got capulates can you see that yeah y'all can see them. look these joints is fire man this is where all the snoop dog joints was coming from and all that stuff man so you know uh yeah hold on let me can we go here Boom, let's go right here. This is where all the Snoop Dogg joints and all that was coming from, like stuff like that. But this is where you just, you pretty much, you just, you just uh, upload the joint, it finds your face. And then, you know, it just goes through there and and it'll just make make uh, avatars for you. I think them joints is fire. And I think that a lot of, a lot of, hey, I ain't gonna lie, a lot of these, a lot of the content creator, uh, a lot of the graphics designers for these content creators, man. They shaking in their boots a little bit, man. But anyway, last but not least, man, I just want to hit y'all with this one right here, bro. This was something that is absolutely insane. He said, hey, hit it, show me when you see what happened, bro. So check this out. We're gonna, we gonna do this right here. Boom. You see what's happening right here, right? Right here, Porshingas is the one that files Kareem. This is the file right here. Bang, hold on, where we go, we go. Boom. He gets fouled. But look at what is going to happen next. Porshingas clearly filed Kareem, and it says that Kareem filed Porshingas. So now Porshingas is on the line. He shoots the ball. And, like, how you get the ball back, bro? Come on, 2K, man. You can't make a, a, a mistake that's that egregious. I think, I'm pretty sure dude was about to spend the night on Porzingis and score that right there. He fired him because he didn't want to score. But then, hey, you get the ball back and you do that. But anyway, y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comment section, man. That's one of them where Don Work said, when 2K wants you to lose, you're going to lose, man. And that's just how it go. But anyway, y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comment section, man. Uh, like I said, the patch notes, they were good. And I'm glad that they did put them out. We really were only worried about the gameplay changes, so those joints is fire. But um, I, I just think that, you know, some of the things that we do want them to work on, they need to be worked on a little bit too. And like I said, somebody was talking about, you know, when you quit out and you're losing your GOAT status. At first, I didn't understand what they were saying, but now I understand that, yo, you're losing your GOAT status when you quit out from that screen right there. So like if a bot would have walked in and you say, I don't want to play with the bot and you quit out right there, then you're losing your GOAT status. Or if a 66 overall walks in and you leave from their screen, you're losing your GOAT status. I just think that's that's a little bit excessive. I do understand why they're doing it because they don't want you to be able to circumvent the system by quitting. But at the same time, that's a little bit excessive, man. You know, Mike, we, we might need to visit that, man. But anyway, y'all, let me know what y'all think down in the comment section, man. We're gonna try to get Big Dog Banner today for the interview. If I can't get him today, we'll get him tomorrow. And uh, you know, uh, and, and that's gonna be Lockdown University 101, man. That, that dude right there, he really be out there playing defense. And if y'all know any other good locks man that want to get on and try to break down some video y'all let me know man and i'm holla y'all next time till next time it's your boy jay easy aka fresh from the barbershop bk the people's champ Gosh,